Considering the next big thing in generative AI, whether you are developing autonomous agents, LLM powered tools or AI first platforms, AWS is ready to back you up. Let me introduce you to the powerful opportunity, the AWS Generative AI Accelerator Program. This is a global eight week hybrid accelerator program designed specifically for startups working in generative and agentic AI. It's more than just mentorship or funding. It's a launch pad to help you scale fast and prove what's possible. Having a great idea isn't just enough. Success in AI depends on having the right tools, expert guidance, and a community that supports your journey as well. That's exactly what AWS brings to the table. From compute credits and infrastructure to direct access to AI ML experts, this program gives you your this program gives your startup everything it needs to accelerate. Now, what do you get? Selected startups get up to $1 million in AWS credits, hands-on guidance from AI experts and venture capitalists, business and technical mentorship, exposure to AWS's global customer base, and you will also get access to cutting edge tools and infrastructure. All of this designed to help you go from idea to impact at a lightning speed. This is ideal for early stage startups innovating in areas like foundation models, multi-model systems, autonomous agents, AI infrastructure, and generative AI applications. So if you're ready to turn your AI vision into reality with the backing of one of the biggest cloud providers in the world, check out AWS Generative AI Accelerator program. The applications are now open and do not miss out on this opportunity. And I will provide the link to this in the description box below. Please note that the applications are going to close on 10th of July, 2025. Now let's see what are the application requirements and see how we can apply to this program. As you can see here, this is the landing page as soon as you log in uh, or land into this particular website. And here you can also read all the benefits. Uh, you can see here credits to help you build and you will get eight weeks of advanced expertise and you will also get go to market opportunities along with community of innovators. And one cool thing is that you will be given complimentary tickets to AWS reInvent program as well. And as I told you, this is how the application timeline looks like. The application window is now open between June 10th till July 10th, 2025. So you just have five days to apply. So be ready. Uh, the application requirements are really simple. I'll show you and walk you through as well. And you will be notified about your cohort by the you know second week of September. And the announcement will be done on 24th of September 2025. And you will be spending first week in Seattle. That is from October 13th till 17th. And the final week at AWS reInvent in Las Vegas. That's very, very cool part. Right. So now let's see how to apply. So there is only one requirement, which is to have a builder ID. So now you might ask me, what's a builder ID? Now what the community engagement that you do with AWS, you will have to create something called as builder account. Okay. So if you do not have one, just click on sign up and you need to provide your personal email address and you, you will have to provide some details like where you're working. And if you're working, you can provide that else. If you're a student, you can provide that student as well and provide some information and you will be able to log in. Now, uh, if you are having uh, the builder account already, just go ahead and click on apply now. Uh, uh, you can also check the eligibility criteria by checking or clicking on this, uh, am I eligible? Okay. Now I've already logged in and this is how uh, the uh, you know program form looks like. As you can see, uh, it's you know going to close on 10th of July, 2025. Right. So uh, you, you need to be filling this application before that. All you have to do is provide all these details like about you and your company, traction and milestone, technology, program specific details, supporting materials and other information. Once you have these details, you can just submit the application. All right. So here, as you can see, you need to provide your LinkedIn profile URL, the company website URL. And when was the company founded? Uh, is it incorporated? Or uh, is it having a form of, you know, legal entity already like LLC, LLC, LTT or private limited and things like that. If there is, if you have already registered it, go ahead and submit yes, I'll submit no. And uh, what your product, what's your product stage at the moment? So are you ideating or you're building it or you have already launched it and you're scaling it, things like that. You can 
describe that here okay and you need to just describe about your company in just two sentences and i would recommend you know filling this if you're in an early stage startup i would recommend you know for your you know cto or vp or any of the engineering manager uh, teams to you know go ahead and submit this because if you see here which of the full time uh, technical roles are filled uh, on your role so the, the, those are the requirements here and you will also need to describe what problems you are solving today all right so and what are the competitive landscapes uh, the product differentiation part you have at the moment you need to submit that as well and uh, what's the biggest challenge that you're encountering at the moment you can also submit that and uh, if your company started generating revenue go ahead and fill that information as well if not uh, just go with no and avoid uh, what i would say is while filling out this uh, you know program uh, i've already spoken with some of my friends who got this uh, credits last year so what they recommended is that avoid you know filling other uh, as an option here right so you see this other option right so stop using that uh, instead if if it's no mention no if it's yes give the exact numbers all right so uh, and uh, if your you know company has gone through a funding round just mention that if you it's a bootstrap select bootstrap no funding select no funding and things like that right so uh, how much did you you know raise if you have already raised some money so how much did you raise fill in that information as well and describe what are the technology that you are using at the moment like what is the current tech stack looks like and all those information should be provided and if you are hosting it somewhere what is the host uh, technology that you are using at the moment like it can be digital ocean or any other cloud provider so you can mention that as well or select from here right so again you will have to you know provide your aws account id because to that account itself the credit will be transferred so make sure to provide that uh, you know account id and uh, you will have to select what are the how you are you know building this generative ai models today uh, either by using bedrock or you are managing it on self um, or you are using direct model api and things like that you can select that as well and um, how are you incorporating ai ml learning into your product you need to select this as well like uh, are you building ml tools or training a model from scratch things like that should be selected and what are the three technical pain points you have when building generative ai applications you need to select that as well like improving the accuracy of the rag system uh, preparing data sets for the model tune fine tuning and things like that right so those things should be clearly declared and uh, does your founding team identify you know with an underrepresented community if so how if it is uh, describe that as well and uh, if you have a co-founder uh, if you if you are a founder and who is uh, you are the one who is applying for it then you will also have to provide you know if if you do not have that's not a problem because that's an optional field but if you have a co-founder go ahead and fill this details as well and then uh, you know select all the uh, other uh, details and i think the re rest of the form is you know pretty uh, uh, decent and uh, you will have to provide uh, for some of the marketing details and uh, you should be good to go right so it's pretty self explanatory and there is nothing uh, you know out of the box you can provide a, a pitch deck a product you video url and uh, if you have uh, how did you hear about this one if you hear it uh, you know from a social media platform or or by watching my youtube video you can just you know uh, send that information here as well and once you have that prepared go ahead and submit the application and i wish you all the best i think uh, you know we are in an era where everyone is going to start uh, something of their own and i believe that most of us will be able to do that as well and such accelerator programs helps us really in building uh, products which will be useful to the society with that i would conclude this video thank you if you are liking the video that i'm creating please consider subscribing and share it with your friends thank you and i will see you in the next one